Welcome back to the Hanging With Web Show. I'm GW Pomacher. Thank you so much for logging on and tuning in. If you haven't done it yet, go on out and hit subscribe for us so you can come back and see some amazing artists, authors, filmmakers, creators of all kinds. We've got cosplayers down there. We are at MegaCon Tampa Bay. Wow. Yeah. Amazing down there, isn't it? Oh, yeah. It's awesome. Wow. Um, we're here hanging with Austin Janowski, an artist, an actor, the producer of Dawn and the Dead, which will be premiering right here at Megacon Tampa Bay. Yep. Uh, Saturday at 4 o'clock. Yep, room 12. Room 12? Yep. By the time you guys see this, you won't know what any of that means, but what you will know is that you missed an amazing premiere. It's going to be a big premiere. It, it's fantastic. Um, now... I know a lot of our, our viewers will remember we, we talked before when you yep. were when you were putting everything together. Yep. Um, and now here we are. We're at the we're at the premiere. I know. The premiere episode one. Yeah. So when we talked last, yeah. in Orlando, mm -hmm. we actually shot a scene uh, for an extra insert that's going to be going into the series. So the pilot that we're doing is a little bit different. Uh, we shot it here right in Tampa Bay. Use Tampa Bay actors, Tampa Bay crew, and everything. Awesome. So, Florida. But what we're going to do tomorrow is for the premiere, you're going to be able to see that plus what we shot in MegaCon Orlando. Fantastic. Yeah. Wow. Um, we, we actually have some great interviews set up. Mm hmm. Uh, we hope that everybody out there on YouTube and on the World Wide Web will keep coming back to the Hanging with Web Show because we're going to meet cast members, we're yep. going to meet uh, crew members. Yep. Um, uh, and just talk to them about their experience on the film set. But you know, since we talked, then you're doing those film sets, and now yes. all the editing and everything that goes into putting out your pilot uh, episode, and then the, and the additional footage from MegaCon. Uh, what is what has your last six months been like? Oh my goodness! <laughs> well, now it's uh, it's been fantastic. We, um, my wife and I, are very blessed, and she's a little going crazy with how busy. I've, I've kind of been with not only doing some comic book stuff, you know, mm -hmm. still doing Divine Retribution, um, still getting zombies off the ground and whatnot, getting a prequel comic book for Dawn and the Dead. Um, but as an actor, it's just... I We've been know. following as, yeah. as your career sort of... Per, it's, you're, you're right there, man. It's, it's, it's the, it's it's the edge of the precipice. It's kind of weird. Yeah. Yeah. I, um, like I was in a, a Florida lottery commercial a couple of weeks ago. Awesome. Um, I was in the Hollywood feature Epiphany. I had a role that sh shot in Tarpet Springs. Nice. Um, so yeah, I've, um, I've got a TV show that I'm, I'm a part of called Grey Room, which is starting shooting um, October 14th. Wow, okay. So I've got a role as Carl in that. Um, and that's for 12 episodes. Um, so now let me ask you, yeah. rewind just a few years okay. back. Go ahead. Okay. You're, you're all in, full, you're acting. You're out there doing a lot of yeah. stuff. You're producing and directing. Yep. You're writing a lot more stuff now. Yeah. You're, even on the comic book side, you're doing so much more now. Yeah. Did you ever have a moment just a few years back when you just knew this is where you were headed, or is this just like whacking you right upside the head? No, I whacked me upside the head, no clue whatsoever. Uh, two or so years ago, I was still doing comic book stuff. Um, I was still working as a creative director for a small agency, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? And never even, acting never even crossed my mind. It wasn't even a thought. And um, yeah, to be where I'm at now, no. Yeah, that, no, it's, 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 it's crazy. It, it's funny how that journey yeah. just sort of, it grabs you. Yeah. When you find that thing and it just sort of, there you are. Man, I'm just, I'm, I'm the ball, like we talked about Orlando, how the ball's rolling. It's just, it's still rolling. It's still, that's, it's, that's it's amazing. That's fantastic. Speed. 
it's got momentum. Yeah. You know, we've talked to people around the convention today. They're looking forward to the premiere tomorrow. Yeah. So it is. It's fantastic. So, um, okay. I, I, I just for my cues every once in a while, I sure. look up to see what they've got for <laughs> it's me. Okay. Okay. And I, I usually expect them to tell me, you know, like move for faster yeah. or whatever. YouTube. Yeah. You guys know. You see me look at the cards. You guys know. Um, and we're talking about as well. We're talking about ball rolling downhill. We're talking about the, the momentum, sheer momentum yes. of the accidental career path. Yeah. This is, this is. Yeah. This, this is just wants supposed to, know, to be fun. How's the art going? The art, well, <laughs> so, the, the art. The, um, the unfortunate thing with my art, uh, I'm doing a lot more writing. Art, yeah. 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 Uh, writing is going great. As an artist, as an inker, whatnot, I've slowed down the past two or so years. I, I've been dealing with very severe tendonitis. It that, doesn't seem to be getting. It is. It's hard. You know, yeah. I don't have tendonitis. But I once tried to draw a stick figure, and my brain and my hands apparently do not communicate yeah. at all. I, I, they have, there's a relationship issue there. I can't mm. seem to work past. And we've, your work is incredible, and that sucks to, well, to all yeah. of a sudden find out you can't use your hands the way you want to. You have a high, high quality expectation that you've done mm -hmm. in the past. You're not quite able to do that. So for me, it was more of a stubbornness like oh i can still do it oh, i can push through it and things would take longer to do and then deadlines would get missed and whatever so now i know my limitations i can't quite do it as as good the or man as says limitations <clears throat> but he's got a pretty full plate well yeah You're, yeah you yeah. What you've had in limitations, you've made, more than made up for in ambition, artistic ambition because now exactly, you're yeah. filmmaking acting yeah. uh like i said producing directing yeah. writing yeah. Um, just a lot of stuff. Um, what are you most excited about for t tomorrow's premiere? What are you, is there, is there just a, a moment that you just are looking for? Well, I'm very excited to see people's expression throughout watching the, the, the pilot and seeing the reaction at the end. Because mm -hmm. the end is going to really be the catalyst to kind of bring things forward. I just want to hear their feedback too. We are going to have... Um, Work, you know, not worksheets, but, you know, things to fill out. What you like, didn't like. Mm -hmm. You know, is it good, not good? What would you change? Getting feedback so we can do better because you can always improve. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? We're, it, we're, this is a learning process for us, too. I think being an artist you know? is never something that you, you settle into. It's something yeah. that you, that you, it is a journey in and of itself. If oh, you're yeah. a creator, you don't just, okay, this is what I do now. Oh, it's yeah. just a constant feedback, constant loop that you're on of, right. of trying to become better right yeah. and so so i'm looking at the camera because i want them to know artists we're very insecure people okay when it's it's acting or art or whatever so we need that validation we need to know oh that's really good stuff oh that's really amazingly good stuff oh that's awesome right okay. so look guys like you heard it from every guest that's ever sat in that chair we need stars we need reviews we need feedback a little bit of applause doesn't hurt. Nope. Your comments down below, they don't hurt our feelings at all. We need it. Yeah. It's what reminds us that being a creator has some fulfillment. Right. Because someday they might even pay us to do it. What? All right. Like, I'm getting crazy okay, now, all right? Hold on, please. Just take a minute. <laughs> um, take a beat. Yeah. Just go on. I mean, it's just... Woo. Okay, really, yeah. we got crazy there for a minute. Okay, okay. We're, we're back. To, we're back to it. We're, we're good back. Then. We're good. Okay. Yeah. All right. See, some of those people are. I uh, never mind. That. None of them are. <laughs> anyway. Um, okay. So we got to that fun part of the show now. Okay. All right. Only we're, we're gonna. I'm gonna mix these up. All right. She's gonna mix them up for me. Okay. All right. Um, because we're we're premiering, Dawn and the Dead this weekend. Dawn and the Dead. It's yes. It's a zombie film. TV show. TV show. It's okay. Excuse it's me. Film. It's, film. Yeah. There, there's no film anymore. I mean, they, like the three guys in the world are still cranking film out. It's still, it's all digital. It's stuff, all yeah. digital now. Sure. So, um, but we're gonna warp our, our all of our fun questions around so they okay. have something to do with Dawn and the Dead. Ooh. Okay. So, hmm. best zombie pickup line. Hmm. Ding 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 ding. Ding, ding, ding. Really? You just I'm made sorry. I think I dropped my heart. Can you pick it up, please? Oh, very huh? nice. Huh? Nice. Thank Applause. you. Applause. We need Thank this. You so Come much. on, yes, YouTube. Validation, remember? Validation. 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 Okay. 
Um, what is the equivalent <laughs> in zombie land <laughs> of a food fight? <laughs> I told you I was, I was going to mix these up and warp these up a little bit. We're going to have some fun. Okay. Say that one more time. All right. We, we, we all know from the lunchroom back in high school, yeah. or, you know, I was in a locker when right. they were doing it, but yeah. what a food fight is. Right. Well, in the world of zombies, what's yeah. a food fight look like? Oh, it's Slim You're Pickens. Filmmaker. <laughs> right? I, was, I like <laughs> Slim Pickens. Slim Pickens. Yep. Google it, folks. You'll get there. It's okay. Uh, <laughs> what would a zombie's favorite candy bar be? Ladyfinger. Ooh. Come on. Boom. He didn't even hesitate. See that? Y'all like that. saw that coming. Boom. We're here with Austin Janowski, artist, actor, producer of Dawn and the Dead. Yes. And we have been hanging out at Megacon Tampa Bay, where we are getting ready for the premiere of episode one of Dawn and the Dead. Yes. And um, so movie premiere, for those of you who are watching this and you're wondering, gee, what was I doing that weekend? What you weren't doing is at 4 p.m. in room 12 here at Megacon Tampa Bay, you weren't probably watching Dawn of the Dead with thousands of adoring fans. I'm, we're, we're, we're hoping for thousands. We'll take hundreds, though. Hun hundreds of thousands. Hundreds of thousands, absolutely. <laughs> we got to wrap it up. Okay. Uh, wow, that's fast. Um, this is our second interview with Austin, and you're always a fantastic guest. Thank you so Thank much you so for much hanging for having with us, me. man. I appreciate um, it. Well, as we wrap it up, let's say thanks to our partners and our friends over at Some Unique Magazine, Space Coast Comics, Wordfire Press, Famous Faces and Funnies, Off the Chain Radio with Yvonne Mason, and of course our great friends downstairs, right down there, Mark Who 42. Uh, we, we had the great, we were on a uh, podcast web show uh -huh. panel earlier. It was kind of cool. That's fun. Yeah. I got to talk about, like, I got to talk about, like, what I do. Mm. It's a really small conversation. Oh, come on. They do a lot. Me, True. I, just, I sit here talk to you. you it's talk fun. To me, yeah, get the cue cards and just kind of like, oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, I'm supposed to do that. Uh, oh, I'm supposed to do that. Look at that. <laughs> I'm GW Pomacher, and we have been hanging with Austin Janowski, a filmmaker, artist, actor, producer of Dawn and the Dead. Uh, by the time you guys are watching this, you guys will be looking all over YouTube. Uh, Look on the world wide web. Google Dawn and the Dead. Go on the website. Yeah. Go on the website. Dawn and the Dead. Check out. Uh, episode one will be out by then, probably. And no, not the episode one. Season, we've got the three, we've got the, the teaser. We've got um, the intro. Mm -hmm. uh, we've got the cast of characters in the synopsis. Anything that you want to know about, about what is going to be coming about Dawn and the Dead, go to the website dawnandthedead.com. Facebook Dawn and the Dead. You can go there too, and because uh, we'll do updates, characters, storylines, where we're going to be next, what we're going to be like. Awesome. We're doing. Um, the Necro Comic Con, we're going to be Necronomicon. Yeah, we're going to be outstanding. There. Yeah, we'll be there. Um, the Florida Horror Horror uh, Film Festival, we're going to be awesome. there too. Awesome. So, and we'll have cast and and crew all for there also. Awesome, guys. So, so. check the links down below. You're going to find links to all of Austin and Donna and the Dead's uh, social media links, websites, you name it. It's down there in the description. While you're down there, leave a comment. Feedback, or, or people. A, feedback. You know, Thumbs, thumbs up. ups are great. Okay, we can live on thumbs up. Well, he's a For zombie. Now. They, they. Yeah. They freak. <laughs> anyway. So, all right, guys. You two, remember, folks. Subscribe. Log on. Tune in and see who we're hanging with next.